I never had gotten out. Maybe after this I finally could. It was a fool's hope. I had no choice. I had to do it. That didn't make me any less terrified. Yo, 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 rerun that right back. We're gonna keep this intro short, man. CNL, Lex Gaming, you already know the vibes. Links in the video. Hey, that last part, man, it was so hard, um, as in a, in a good way. Bruh. Had to run it back. Same clothes, same day. Let's get it. Parliament Tower. It was back. I'd been here many times before. I didn't know how many. This felt different, like my last chance. If it wasn't already too late. Scratch was in there, writing his horror story. There was still time to stop him. I needed to get inside. I... I'm so tired. He's here all the time now. There's so much rage inside of him, I can't stand it anymore. made a decision. Most of you won't understand. People call me an artist. But I don't care about any of that. I just wanted to show the world what I see. I can't keep going like I have been. It's time for a perspective shift. To go from photographer to subject. From artist to art.
Alice was dead. Scratch tortured her until she couldn't stand it anymore. Until she broke. And all that time, she thought it was me. Scratch was still here. He hadn't escaped the dark place yet. He was scratching my edits out of return. <laughs> I had seen this before. This was not Scratch. This was me. Caught in a loop. I had stopped myself trying to fix the manuscript. I was the one haunting Alice. It was always me. I killed her. to lead you on. Your friends will meet him when you're gone. Face Nightingale in the overlap. Hey! Are you okay? Oh, no! It's my fault! He got out with my face! Scratch! That night I found Wake here. He appeared because of this. The summoning. That was Wake. Scratch wasn't pretending to be Wake. They're the same Scratch. person. Bitch. He's here! Scratch! Watch out, Anderson! Estevez, Scratch is Wake, with the dark presence inside him. He wants the clicker. Change of plan. I'll lure him to the cell. When we're inside, lock it. And blast it with all you got. Anderson, pin him down with gunfire for me to get the light on him. On it. Damn it. Anderson, we lost oh. power. Oh. It's back up. You got fighting blood in you, Tenno! We're here for you, Tenno! Now, Estevez! Slow enough. Bruh. Show him, kiddo! You bring that family to mess with devil. The lights, Estevez! They got the trap. Go, go, go! That's we one. Power. He's free. Need to get the other one. I'll fix it. We can hit him well. again. Need to rotate the light. How do I block that? 
You're gonna be sorry, Spock. Oh. Official. Tear Fest is cancelled. Today, Bright Falls feels a little less bright. So now I'm back, Alan. Wait. Tom! We need to get to our next gig. We're doing this for you and our lovely saga. You take care of things on this side. Don't screw it up, Tom! I'd seen it all play out. Like a horror movie I'd been forced to watch. The Dark Presence held all the cards now. What in the... I think that was an overlap. We done lost Saga, bruh. Casey done gone crazy. Hey, over here. 
Thought I can't, I still can't open them. Nah, I, I ain't got nothing but a flashlight. Oh my God. She got shot in the leg. Hey man, talk to me. Welcome back, Wake. You are Wake now, right? With the shadow out of you? Some good news, at least. Bad news is, I haven't seen a situation this fucked since the AWE in Eagle River. The shadow's now in Alex, and Anderson is gone. We need to figure out how to salvage this. I'll do anything it takes to fix this, Agent Estevez. I'm the reason this is all happening. It's never that simple. But I should have put you in a box and shipped you off to a containment facility the second I laid eyes on you. <laughs> the only question now is... Are you able to fix this? I can try. Not the most encouraging answer, but we'll make it work. Scratch. The dark presence inside Casey. It threw Saga into the lake. If she ends up in the dark place, she could be there forever. It took me 13 years to get out. Zane never did. Tor and Odin went in after her, right? Maybe they'll get her out. With the power of rock and roll. I saw them when I was trapped there. They performed in my musical. <laughs> I'm immediately less optimistic about this. What's the situation? I've never seen an entity break a bureau containment unit like that. And now the Dark Presence is occupying Agent Casey? When it attacked him in the woods, it must have been preparing for this. And now he has the clicker. Scratch will go to Bright Falls and use the clicker to bring about the horrific ending he wrote for Return. But I can still fix this. How? Scratch must have the manuscript. If I can read the ending, I can rewrite it. I need to go after him. Well, you won't get very far without these. This plan is a real Hail Mary wake. I wish I could help, but this is all on you. We ain't got no I choice. I got you every kind of weapon we have available. Don't fuck it up. Fuck it up, fuck it up, fuck it up. I needed a car. The FBI vehicle would be at the parking lot. Okay. Damn, bro. We really messed this place up. So, let's go to the parking lot. I'll see y'all when I get there. I was awake again. Clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime. I was back exactly where I left. A dark forest outside Bright Falls. A gun in one hand. A flashlight in the other. Haunted by my own writing. Alice taken from me. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. He was, he was spitting for a little bit, wasn't he? Bruh. I thought he was about... Water. The water's <laughs> What? Hey man, I ain't got no beef with you. Bro came running up on me, didn't he? Let's me know I'm going the right way though. Look at that light over there. We're gonna fight again. Okay. 
attack. Please tell me that's it. Or y'all got some more bullets for me or something. Damn, that was crazy. Right, see, that's all my damn battery. In the dark place, the dark presence went into me. When I was pulled back here, crossing over and weakened it, made it dormant. I couldn't remember what had happened, but I could feel it getting stronger, waking up. I thought it was hunting me, closing in. It was inside me the whole time, and then it took over. It turned me into scratch. I was awake again, clear-headed for the first time in what felt like a lifetime. I was back exactly where I left. A dark forest outside Bright Falls. A gun in one hand, a flashlight in the other. Haunted by my own lighting. That was taken from me. I knew what I had to do. Stop the horror story from coming true. Stop the dark presence. Bro, you just repeating yourself? I gave you props earlier for, for spitting a little bit. You had a little couple bars. You just, you just, you can't recycle bars, bro. Right? Nah, it's unacceptable. Brother, ugh. Bro said everything come true. My favorite color blue. What it do? What? I get to the yep, parking lot. Damn, that's sad. I had to get to Bright Falls. See this through to the end. Yep, we're on the way. I brought Saga Anderson into this story to help me escape. She succeeded. It cost her everything. I'd used Alex Casey in my writing for years. The real Casey had been drawn here because of that. Now he was a victim too. Saga. Casey, Alice, all this horror originates from me. It's my fault. Scratch had to be stopped. I've driven down this road before. Been driving on it forever. If Scratch had brought the dark place here, this would take me back inside. In 2010, I had dived in, a leap of faith for Alice, with no idea that the cost would be a nightmare worse than death. It had taken me 13 years to get out. Now Alice was dead because of me. And I was gonna make that leap again, this time knowing the cost all too well. to look 
look at it? I had brought the dark place here with me. I never had gotten out. Maybe after this I finally could. It was a fool's hope. I had no choice. I had to do it. That didn't make me any less terrified. This is not what I expected. Alan Wake is this generation's greatest storyteller. <laughs> Girl, calm down. Bruh. Appreciate you, my boy. Come up here. If it ain't the old gods of Asgard, we won't want it. I needed to get a copy of Return. I needed to read the ending to have a shot at changing it. I was inside Scratch's ending, a perverse version of reality. The townspeople brainwashed. Everyone and everything revolved around Return, as if it had just been published. I need to get a copy, bro. How much? The tragedy of Tagalus Kirkheimley is a blatant commentary on a woman's struggle to balance her personal and professional lives. This is the flow. And why he always is hitting the trilogy's exciting conclusion at Deerfest. Yeah, the whole folks. week's return, a genre bending mixture of fact and fiction. I can't get over there. Yeah, I can't. Where do I sign up to live in the Valhalla nursing home? <laughs> These residents are laugh out loud funny! Bro, they out here in they towels. I'm just not gonna find a random copy of Return somewhere. Okay. <laughs> I could see the round windows of the writer's room in the photo. That's where I had to go. To rewrite the ending of Return. It's a sick, sick story. <laughs> Room to stop this horror story. This was an obsessive, egocentric nightmare, all revolving around a vain monster of a writer and his final divine work of art. The novel returned come true. It wouldn't stop here, it would keep spreading.
Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, close them just in case. I needed to reach the writer's room. Write a new conclusion. Was Scratch's insecure need for fame, for praise, drawn from my psyche? I would bring his sick fantasy crashing down around him. This is the uh, Valhalla nursing home. Where Tor and um, Odin is at. Of course, I can't just walk in through the... I had to find another way inside. Of course. It's not like I could just... <laughs> How easy would that be, you know what I'm saying? Okay, and I can't... Okay, don't have a map. Don't have a map. That makes sense. That makes sense. Okay. So let me see. Let me guess. Just... I was able to get down here at one time. Okay, nothing. Bruh. So I'm gonna just follow the light. Yep, I'm gonna just go over there to the light. You know, I can imagine everything else. I can imagine everything else is locked or I can't access it. Right, right, right. Just follow the light. What? Alice? What was that? Alice was dead. Was this a trap? Or was Scratch torturing me? Might be a little bit of both. I seen the TV on. What? Was it? Oh, hold on, I can't be that tripping. I can't be tripping like that. I get a little talkative when I get nervous, so uh, please excuse me. I need to feel like y'all here with me. Cause I don't like the way the, this light system is set up. This solo flashlight in this heavy dark room. I feel like Resident Evil. I hate Resident Evil. No shot to the devs at Resident Evil. We love y'all. Love to collab with y'all. Just follow her, how about that? You know? I'm steady trying to loot, you know? Uncle loot. Okay, can't get up in there, so I guess we're not meant to go down this way. All right now. Game saving. She down there. And I see you. Okay. Let me check around this corner. All right, nothing. Oh, we. Check these doors. Shit, smash! All right, damn, some more running. Diner. 
How are you here? <laughs> I'm here to save you, silly. <laughs> I got your instructions. I found every hidden message you left for me. In the radio, in the wind, in the forums on my Alan Wake fan site. What? No, Rose, I haven't been leaving you any messages. Oh, I get it. Yes, Alan, only a crazy person would think you've been leaving them secret messages. <laughs> Wink. But now you need to get your butt upstairs, Alan. This shit won't write itself, no matter what William Shakespeare said. Right. Thank you, Rose. I'll do what I can. Okay. That's it. We can't say nothing else to her? All right. Y'all was like, man, what in the world is going on? Upstairs. The writer's room must be in the attic. That's where the windows were. So that's where he wrote this. We loop around and come to Ketterton. I have put everything ready for the visitors. I'll come to wash the floor of your room next. All you need is water and Vileda. Water is the oldest bulb. Mm -hmm. Water finds its way. What water brings, it takes away. Good point. It can be clean or dirty. It can mm -hmm. give life or drown it. Right, okay. right. I didn't expect to see you here, but it makes sense. Can you help me find my way? One last time. Mm, now there's a devil in the fist trap. Don't be spooked by it so that shit won't start beating your underpants. Hmm? Okay. I'll get the door open for you, Tom. Appreciate that, my boy. There you go. The matter is a stake. Now comes the end of the rhyme. Thank you, Ati. Yeah, appreciate that, man. I was here. I needed to write the ending. I only had one chance to get this right. I needed an ending that took everything already in return and extended it into a conclusion that would save us. Only the perfect ending would work. Eternal Deer Fest. Return's ending was an eternal Deer Fest that would keep spreading. Given time, Scratch would plunge the world into his nightmare. I had to stop that from happening. I had to write one more chapter for Return. A perfect ending that would save us all. I was the only one who could write it. Everything depended on this. On me. Any second now, Scratch would burst through that door to stop me. Every plot thread dangled in my brain. It suddenly felt impossible. Something stirred in the room, coming to me. An idea. Mm-mm. Echo. The ending has to fit the genre if it's going to work. In a horror story, there's only victims and monsters. If there is Aero, they will ultimately pay a heavy price. I won't let the horror story take Logan and Casey. They were dragged into this. They need to survive. Non-negotiable. Not just them. We need to try to save everyone. The ending will have to be dark no matter what. The more people we save, the greater the cost. And the hero must pay the price. The scales always need to balance. Hmm. Better not be Saga.
Something felt different. I'd never seen myself in a vision before, but it fit. Saga and I were both at the center of this story. She was now my co-author. This was the beginning of the end. We were characters in a horror story, charging blindly towards the finale. We still didn't have everything we needed. This would not work without the clicker. Okay, like I suspected, you know what I mean? I figured that this would kind of be more of a setup episode, which is why I felt the need to go ahead and knock out two in the same day. So, um, like I said, man, I ain't had no intro, but hey, man, I, hey, man, how your mama in them? You know what I'm saying? Prayers and blessings. How your mental health? Focus good. Prayers and blessings. You know how we rock. But man, that's a hell of a story, man. I'm, it's, I'm excited for the finale. You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, if you made it this far, I definitely. Bruh. Damn. This damn core. If you made it this far, I definitely appreciate it. You already know the vibe. C N L X Gaming with the X is silent. Got the links up in the video. Um, keep hitting me in my DMs, man. Keep hitting me in my comments, telling me what games you want me to play. Tell me uh, how trash I am. And you know what? Let me add it like a little caveat to that. Tell me what games you want me to play. Oh my God. You can tell me, but ultimately it's up to me if I'm gonna play it. You feel me? What? Don't pressure me into playing something. I need, you know, if more than one person tells me. You know, I'd be, I may be more inclined to do that, but keep on telling me what games you want me to play, man. You feel uh -huh. me? So I appreciate it. All the feedback, regardless. Um, but to the next time, I hop. Said it was up and it was stuck.